Hey guys, what's up? This is Ziploc Rules 2013, and welcome, 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 welcome to the finale of Let's Play Super Monkey Ball Jr. It is, it is really that time. We just finished up, it feels weird, I'm concluding two Let's Plays within like a week of each other, so that's really weird. I don't know, it just seems really weird, but yeah, Super Monkey Ball Jr. Uh, it's pretty much done. We are going to be, this is going to be a very short episode, but we're going to be checking out the expert stages that are available in this game. Now, I'm not exactly sure how many there are, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to, I don't know how many extra stages there are, but basically when you complete um, a difficulty in the main game, if you can beat it without using any continues, so you do it without run, running out of lives, you unlock a set of extra stages. So, in this case, uh, it's actually set in outer space. Which is really cool. It actually looks really, really awesome. But, yeah, you're gonna have these real cool levels that are set in outer space. Ooh, we got a one up there. So, uh, I don't think I died at all while trying to... Oh, shit. I didn't die at all. I just fucking ran myself off. Damn. Okay, but I don't think I died at all trying to get to this point, but yeah, we're basically just gonna complete these expert stages uh, today. That's really all there is to do this episode. And again, I don't really know how many of these there are um, in beginner, so I don't really know how long I'm gonna be playing. There you go. That was floor number one. Floor number two. Now, I did show off these for beginner mode um, in uh, the first episode of the project. So, you probably have seen at least a couple of these if you watched the entire Let's Play, which probably isn't too many of you, but just in case you were here at the beginning, you probably have seen these courses. And uh, it's really cool. Really, just the main thing about it is obviously it's difficult, but. You know, the background, it's outer space, it looks just so weird, but incredibly interesting at the same time. Oh god, this thing goes by fast, we were basically on this one, okay, <laughs> trying to maneuver around the barriers very carefully. And of course, uh, yeah, you can still save your progress here. Um, to get here, like I said, you can't use any continues, but... Once you're here, I'm pretty sure you're safe. Like, you don't go back to the beginning of the entire beginner mode if you run out of lives. At least I'm pretty sure you wouldn't. What the hell? That went freaking fast. Oh, that's ridiculous. But yeah, um... Really, just... I went back. Oh, that is fucking dumb. But yeah, it's really cool that you can unlock these. And like I said, I don't know how many there are, so... Uh, if there aren't too many here on beginner, I might have to go to advanced to uh, unlock some of those stages. But yeah, I, oh my god, that goes fast. It just meets and it's just gone it's so quick. Good god. Um, but yeah, we'll see how this all plays out. I really like this. The stages, I mean, these aren't too difficult. This one, I don't think I got past on the first episode. But yeah, you're moving around these barriers quickly get to the end because it still moves insanely fast even after you hit the finish and um the soda ah good stuff there we go oh that's not it oh is that seriously it oh shit oh god that's it wow that's there's only three of them okay yeah i guess we're I guess I'm gonna have to do a giant old jump cut here. I'm not gonna bother showing off the credits, you've already seen that, but... Okay, I guess there's only three bonus stages for a beginner. Is that how it's gonna be for the entire game? All three modes? Okay, well let me go ahead and get to the advanced ones. That's... I didn't expect that. Uh, BRB, I guess. <clears throat> Alright. We are here on the extra advanced stages. The extra stages for advanced mode. Of these, I don't believe anyway, unless I am remembering wrong. Wow, we just died already, but <laughs> I 
I do not believe we played these at all. I only did one playthrough of uh, advanced mode, and uh, that was on video. So I do not believe I've actually played through any of these bonus stages before. These are all these are all new to me. Oh shit. Okay. Okay, that's just nice. Oh wow. Okay, I guess I have to do a little <clears throat> kind of roundabout there. Uh, make a little trip around. That is something else. Oh my god, it went all the way out. Dang it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, these aren't exactly meant to be easy, so... Yeah, you have to be careful. This look, I just... I was kind of hoping that we'd get a different, you know, background for the sky, but... Overall, I really love this background. You're just in outer space, and it just looks so cool. I don't know. So I guess I'm I'm fine with it being the same every time, just because it looks so freaking so cool, you know? I guess that's a stupid reason to be okay with it, but you know what? I'm That's my reason, and I'm standing by it. Got my perfect bonus there. We got a times four. That was... Very good for our score, which we totally killed with that game over, but, I mean, who goes for score on Super Monkey Ball? Well, I guess, I don't know. See, I'm a very casual Monkey Ball player, so I guess I wouldn't really understand uh, someone uh, doing that just by nature, but, yeah, I don't really care about my score here. If you couldn't tell already by me losing like a hundred thousand points, something like that, hundred, maybe it was like ninety thousand. I don't know. We lost a crap ton of points though. I don't really get why it tells us we have infinite continues. Like why it even bothers saying continues infinite? You know, you have infinite continues, so it should just let you keep continuing. I don't know. I guess felt the need to specify it. I don't know. It's small little detail, but really, really odd at the same time. I'm thinking there's only going to be uh, three extra stages here again, so I, yeah, crap, am I going to go for the expert ones? I might be going for the expert uh, extra stages here, which I was not anticipating, but if we're only doing three on advance, I guess it would only be right to go and do the expert ones too. Or at least to try them. I don't know if I'm actually gonna clear them. Oh, come on. All right, there we go. Some extra bananas. Uh, not gonna go for them, I don't really care. About the perfect score at this rate, but yeah, the pretty simple layout for those. 10,000 points there. <laughs> I mean, Ah, rip my high eye oh, yeah, app, it's only three. Yeah, we're going on to expert alright. Unfortunately, our uh, high score isn't exactly going to be saved as being, yeah, it's only going to be 10,000. Since we went on, it doesn't automatically lock your uh, final score for the main uh, portion of the difficulty. It actually just takes whatever your final score is, so... Big R.I.P. to our 100,000 score, but... Oh, well. Head to end somewhere. Uh, yeah. I mean, this wouldn't be long enough if I didn't do the expert stages, so I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... try and, uh, get those unlocked, so... We'll see you all in a minute. Oh, man. Well, we got it. All right, very well done. All right, so the extra levels on expert. Oh man, that probably, I mean, I don't think I took too long to do that, but ugh, talk about abusing the stupid save cheat. Oh man, I was pulling like a Mario Golf Toadstool tool right there. Just randomly saving my progress and loading up the previous level. Oh god, it worked. <clears throat> It worked, but, uh, man, that was something else getting to this point. Like I said, you can't use any continues <clears throat> if you want to unlock the levels, so, okay. 
Okay, it looks like we're going with this style movement here. Have to kind of skip over from kind of corner to corner here. Uh, not too difficult. I really... I know I said this already, but I just really wish that there were different backgrounds for each difficulty expert stage. Like, I like this background, but... You know, I already, I've already seen it, so... I don't know, I kind of feel like they should have <coughs> changed it up. <clears throat> they just changed the visuals in the background, but... As far as I can tell, it's the same exact thing. From, uh, beginner and, and advanced, but... I mean, it's not bad, it's just kinda... I don't know. It's weird that they use the same thing. Oh, boy. Oh, God, we're gonna be climbing up here, huh? Alright. <laughs> <clears throat> We're scaling the, uh, the cliffside here, I guess. Oh, God. Okay. So, rip my 200,000. Oh, no. No, we're still alive. Rip my uh, 200,000 point score here in a minute. Oh, God. Yep. All right. Well, it was nice having you while it lasted. <laughs> oh, God. <clears throat> that's. I think that's the highest I've ever scored in uh, in this game. But, uh, yeah, I'm afraid that's over. <clears throat> if I, uh, I don't know. Again, if I would have taken a quit right there. Come on, that should have worked. If I would have taken a quit right there, I definitely... Or I would have, you know, gotten to keep the high score. But, you know what? That's just not important. Oh, my God. <laughs> scaling... Okay, I'm not really good at scaling up on these levels. Just going up... <clears throat> on an incline, it's just not my strong suit. No! Oh, I thought there was a flat surface up there. Uh, I thought I could kind of cheese it a little bit, but... Oh, I guess not. Huh, huh, not cheating. Oh, god dang it. Seems that this is the most useful strategy. Uh, oh boy. Oh, oh, ah, oh, damn. All the way over here and boom! Haha! <laughs> Alright. I guess it's probably how you're supposed to do it. It feels so. I feel like I'm cheating when I do that. I have to be honest. It just. It feels like I'm cheating. It just. It just does. Uh. Oh. Alright. There we go. A lot of tight spaces here and oh boy. <clears throat> Some of the ground. Oh, yeah. Those black tiles. Almost on the TV, kind of blend in with the sky. Oh, God. Yeah. The colors are off. By the way, I'm using a CRT now, if you didn't know. To play all my older games off of. And, uh, it's just as, uh, like, obviously my flat screen I have manually set to have vivid colors. But this one has no settings like that. And it's naturally just as bright and not correctly colored. As uh, <clears throat> as my flat screen, it's really weird. I wasn't, I was expecting it to be more accurate here. Don't get me wrong, I like the the brighter colors. Oh my god, I like the brighter colors better. But things like that really put you at a disadvantage when the when the stage kind of blends in with the background, with the uh, with the OB, and it looks perfectly light, perfectly bright on your end, but not here. Like, here I can obviously tell it's all connected, but here where it kind of disconnects, it's kind of hard to tell. Unless you're right up there at the edge. Alright, looks like we're doing better here. Doing better now. Oh! Yep, I, I thought that was a black tile. <laughs> Damn it, okay. Do I? No. There's a tiny bit of input lag with this, so I can't really play off of OBS. That's problematic. <laughs> oh my god. Yep, this is... Ah, damn it. Okay. Here we go. Oh, yep, okay. Gotta remember that that's... Ah, damn it. Got ahead of myself there. Went way too far ahead of myself. Okay. Don't fall for the game's traps. I wonder if they had that in mind. To totally fuck you over. Just make everything blend in, knowing that you'd probably have a miscolored TV. I almost wonder if that was a thing. Oh shoot! I was not prepared for that. <laughs> okay, 
much better, and let's actually react in time. Alright. Carefully come back down. And... Okay. Getting close to the end? Hopefully. Oh boy, almost got fooled there again. Shoot. Oh god, that is so sudden. Like right here- Oh, what? Oh, I didn't think there was going to be a drop-off there. Oh, that is... That is something else. Oh, boy. Haha. <laughs> Man, that is quite the trick jump. You can kind of see it coming. But, you know, from a distance. But, man, you don't have a whole lot of time to react there. That, ladies and gentlemen, is it. I'm I'm sure there's probably bonus stages for uh, Master Mode. Don't... Don't get me started on that, I'm sure there are, but I'm just not up for that right now. I'm sorry, but uh, that is all I'm going to show off. That is the expert stages here in Super Monkey Ball Jr., ladies and gentlemen, for beginner, advanced, and expert. And uh, and then all the mini games. we covered all of that, and we covered uh, Master Mode. We didn't do the bonus stages. I don't even know if there are any, but we didn't do them if there are. And uh, we still did, though, go through the main uh, quest here. We completed the main stages. And I honestly think that this is a good place to leave off at. And uh, that's going to do it for the project, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you all enjoyed uh, Let's Play Super Monkey Ball Jr. for the Game Boy Advance. A very nice uh, kind of... Uh, take on the Super Monkey Ball series, you know, a little transition to a handheld. You could definitely tell it was a very experimental game, obviously. 3D games on the GBA weren't exactly the best, but I'd say they did a lot with what they had here. And it's honestly a pretty decent game. Uh, I found this game, I forget how much I paid for it, a couple, a couple bucks. <laughs> but uh, if you want to check this game out, definitely go ahead and do that. If you have Visual Boy Advance, you can download a ROM, or if you want the real deal, it literally is like a couple bucks if you go on eBay. So look for this, it really doesn't cost much at all. And uh, I definitely would recommend it if you're a Monkey Ball fan. Even if you want to get into Monkey Ball, it's not a bad way to kind of experiment, kind of test your uh, test the waters, what you like and what you might not like. But yeah, that's pretty much it. We went through essentially the entire game. Uh, definitely the uh, where the game is the strongest is in the main game, as expected. But the mini games are nothing to laugh at. There again, there's no monkey target, but you know, with what is there with what they had to work with and what is actually there, it's decent and it's a fun time. So. I'm going to leave it there. I hope you all enjoyed this project, and I will see you all next time for uh, Let's Play Super Mario Bros. Deluxe, the premiere of Let's Play Super Mario Bros. Deluxe. But until then, I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all next time.